to welcome all of you, all of you here in the Czech Republic. I would like to invite and welcome all air chiefs. Thank you very much for coming. We really appreciate and all the beauty of air chiefs. It's our pleasure to be here together with you. Achieving air superiority remains one of the main pillars of successful military operations in the 21st century. The dynamics of technological development, new forms of threats, and changing geopolitical realities are forcing us to seek answers to questions that were not on the agenda just a few years ago. This year's Future Air Force Conference became a place where these answers began to emerge, not only in presentations and panel discussions, but also in practical demonstrations and informal meetings. Good morning, generals, uh, distinguished guests, uh, ladies, gentlemen, and warmly welcome at the, the Future Air Force Conference. We are just about to start. This conference is held under the Chapman House policy. Therefore, you can be absolutely open during the discussion, questions, and everything. This year's Future Air Force Conference was attended by nearly 200 experts and representatives from 34 countries around the world as well as representatives from NATO, namely the Joint Air Power Competence Center and NATO Flight Training Europe. Over the course of two days, more than 20 presentations were given, covering current and future challenges in the development of Air Force capabilities, interoperability between Air Forces, and technological innovations. Alongside senior Air Force officials and experts on aviation personnel training, Representatives of the defense industry also spoke, introducing participants to ways of making aviation training more effective. A new feature of this year's conference was Industry Day. For the first time, the defense industry was given space to present the latest technologies and systems, not only in the form of presentations, but also through static and flight demonstrations. The accompanying program was another strong point of the conference. The highlight was a gala evening at the Military History Institute. The historical setting and the participation of key representatives of the Ministry of Defense and the Czech Air Force Command underscored the festive nature of the event and created an environment where formal discussions naturally turned into personal conversations and informal networking. This year's Future Air Force Conference clearly showed that it is not just a series of lectures and panel discussions. It is a platform where military experience, the Alliance perspective, and industrial innovation meet. The result is a space where concrete visions and real projects are born, with participants from almost all over the world, prestigious guests, and the successful premiere of Industry Day. The conference has taken another step forward and confirmed that the discussion about the future of the Air Force is taking place right here in Prague.